everyone, it's Lara. So today I'm going to share with you the progress I've made with my year-long project pan. So I'm doing 21 products in 2021. And this one is not a rolling style. So once I use everything up, that's it. So I've made some really good progress so far. I actually have quite a few empties. So let me show you what I used up first. So the first thing I used up is this powder. This is the Too Faced Peach Blur Powder. So I was able to use that up. I did like the way this looked on my skin, but I'm not the hugest fan of the texture of this. I think last time I mentioned how it wasn't attached, like the product wasn't, it just kept falling out. So once the middle started getting really thin and I felt like I was about to hit pan, I decided to take out the grid that was underneath, but I didn't realize there was this like film or glue under there as well. So that got in the way, so I tried taking that out and then everything just kind of crumbled apart. And I, I tried repressing it and every time I repressed it, it just would crumble apart and fall apart. So it was kind of difficult to use. And then I tried just breaking it up and trying to use it as a loose powder, but it wasn't breaking apart well enough. <laughs> so it's just really chunky. So yeah, I definitely wouldn't buy that again. The next thing I used up is this concealer. This is from Mio Piccolo. It was okay. The coverage was kind of light, but it was alright while it lasted. I used up this setting spray, the Pretty Vulgar Setting Spray. So when I introduced it, I said that I had moved it to this container, and now it is all gone. The setting spray was okay. I didn't really notice any major differences. I used up the two body spray vials I had put in this project. They're both from Victoria's Secret. One is in electric and the other is Rush. I liked the Rush scent a bit more than the electric one. The electric was kind of like a coconutty, pineapple-y scent, which I'm not crazy about pineapples, so I didn't really like that. It was okay. I was able to use the vial. And this one was more kind of like a musky sweet scent, which I did enjoy. So I did like the Rush one. I used up is my hair item. So this is the Beach Babe Sea Salt Spray in Tropical Banana. So we were about halfway and now we're done. I usually don't mind Not Your Mother's products and this one worked fine. It's just the smell. I cannot stand this Tropical Banana smell. It's way too strong. I'm all set. And the last thing I used up is this nail polish, this e.l.f. nail polish in Pot of Gold. It's what's on my nails now, and it is all done. I really like these e.l.f. polishes, but I'm glad that I was able to use one up. So those are all the items I used up. Let me show you the progress I made with the rest of the stuff. So I was working on this Nivea lip balm. So I'll show you what it looked like when I put it in the project. This is what it looks like now. So still have a dip going on, getting there. Haven't reached the bottom yet, but this is kind of thick, so I can only use a little bit at a time. Next up is this setting powder from ColourPop. I did use this mostly to set my under eyes. I was really trying to focus on that peach one, the Too Faced peach one, so I didn't use this one a whole ton. So this is where we were, and it's still pretty much to that line. It really hasn't changed at all. So I'm not even going to bother marking it since it's pretty much at that mark. I was also working on this setting spray from Heritage Store. So when I put it in, it was up to the top of this label. And now it is right here, so just a little bit of use. I was really working on the Pretty Vulgar one because that one was almost done and I knew that I would be able to get that done by this update, so I really focused on that one. I did use this one some, so I can't really mark the progress on this. This is a liquid liner from Majolica Majorca. It has a clicky button. It's still working. I use it pretty 
much every day. I have been using it a lot, so I feel like it should be running out sometime, but we'll see. I'm still going along with that. <laughs> I have this eyebrow pencil from Pretty Vulgar. So when I introduced it, I was up there and now I am right there. It's getting down there, almost, just a little bit left. And the last kind of pencil stick thing I have is this eyeliner from Crayon Touch Me. So I will show you what it looked like before. That's what we have now. I have been using it. I use it to kind of smudge on my lower lash line. I don't like putting it on my waterline because there are glitters in this but I do really like it smudged on my lower lash line. So usually I'll put an eyeshadow down first and then I will put this on top of the eyeshadow and I really like that look. I have three other nail polishes in this project. I didn't use these two. So we have this one in bubblegum, still halfway, didn't use it. And this one in Mod Mob. This one's also still about halfway. Didn't use that one at all. And then this red one, I did use it about twice, but it still hasn't moved. The line rubbed off. It was about pretty full. And now it's to the top of the F in Elf. So not much progress there. And I was also working on two blushes. So... I'll show you what they looked like when I introduce them. Now, this is what they're looking like. They really don't look any different. I have worn this one almost every day. I'm wearing it today. And there is some kind of like agitation. Like there's maybe starting to be a dip. And this one I used maybe twice. I didn't really use that one. So that one doesn't look any different. These are so tightly packed. I don't I don't know if I'm going to be able to use them up by the end. We'll see. I don't know. There's only four grams of product in each, which I don't think is that bad for a blush, but they're very tightly packed. And the last two items I have are two fragrances. So I was working on this body spray from Bath & Body Works in Dark Kiss. So when I introduced it, it was there, and now it is here. So not a lot of progress because I was focusing on those vials. I really wanted to get those vials used up, which I was able to, so didn't use this a lot. It is kind of a wintry fall scent, so I did use this one a bit more than the other one. The other one I was working on was this Victoria's Secret bombshell one. This is more of a summer spring scent. So I have been wearing it a little bit recently. So the mark was there. It really hasn't moved all that much, just slightly. This is obviously a lot stronger than this one because it's a perfume, whereas this is a body spray. So I don't need a lot of this. Honestly, I really only need one spray and it lasts pretty much all day. So usually I'll spray once in the morning when I'm getting ready. And then after I work out and shower and change into my jammies, I'll spray it again. So I feel like the items I have left in this project are probably gonna take me a while to use up. Not really sure if there's going to be any empties for next update. I'm thinking maybe the eye pencil will be done. I was able to make pretty good progress in one month, so possibly that. I really don't know how much is left in here, so maybe that one. And then I really do hope one of these nail polishes will get used up, but I don't know. But that's all for now. I'll see you next time. Bye!